Hi guys, welcome back for the AT-10. Uh, I'm going to show you the binding procedure uh, for the AT-10. It should be the same as for the AT-9, so here we go. First of all, connect, turn on your transmitter. That's what they say on the um, manual. So then connect the power to your channel 3. So let's go 1, 2, and 3. Let me check. Yes, one, two, three. Connect the power. Find the button right there. Press the button. Where is it? Okay, here we go. Power your receiver. It starts blinking. And it got a solid red. And that's it. So the, R, the, the receiver is bound. One other way that you can see that it is bound is that you already have the telemetry right there for the uh, receiver. So this is the RSSI signal, signal strength for your receiver. And that's it. Now if you turn it off, let's turn it off and connect a servo just for testing. Let's see. Channel one and turn it on. We should have, yeah. So there we go. Oh, sorry, let me take this out of the way. So, yeah. Nice resolution. So, done. It works. So yeah, this was the binding procedure for the uh, Radiolink um, R10D uh, receiver for the that comes with the AT10.